Hi guys, wanted to post a video on how to set up your Commodore Forever Wi-Fi modem. First of all, just plug it right into the user port, chip side up, make sure it's in there nice and firm, boot up your computer, load your terminal software, using uh, CCGMS. 2017 version 6. Now, the first thing you do is enter the settings menu, press F7. We need to change our modem type to user port, change the baud rate to 300, and change the modem type by pressing M, baud rate by pressing B. Now you want to uh, hit return, go back to the graphics terminal, return again to boot up the modem. Now we're going to enter our Wi-Fi information, press F8 to go to the non-graphics terminal. Going to enter our Wi-Fi pa password and ID. Um, ID is AT dollar sign S S I D equals and then whatever your Wi-Fi is. Press return, you get an OK response. Now for the password, AT dollar sign pass equals whatever your password is. Press return, you get an OK response. Now we're going back to the graphics terminal by pressing F8 again. Connect to the Wi-Fi with ATC1. Press return. It'll connect, sometimes it takes a couple times to connect. Connect it pretty quick. So now, we need to change our baud rate. We have to prepare the system if we're gonna go to 9600, which is what I'm gonna do. So we type in the command AT and K1. That's flow control, helps keep the system from locking up. Hit return, we get an OK. Now A, T, and P0, that's the polarity. Hit return, we get an OK. Now we're ready to change the baud rate. So we type in A, T, dollar sign, S, B, as in set baud, equals 9600. Now you just press return. And go straight back into the settings by pressing F7. Change the modem type with M to up 9600. Change the baud rate to 9600. Press S to save these settings. We'll save it as default by just pressing return. Press return again to exit back to the graphics terminal. Now at this point, just press return again and you should see the modem boot up again. If it does nothing like that, just type in ATI. Doesn't matter if it's garbled, just press return. Now you see the modem information. It shows we are connected to our Wi-Fi. It says Wi-Fi state is disconnected, but that means it's not connected to a BBS or making a call at the moment. But you see your Wi-Fi ID, and we're connected. You see your IP address, okay? Now we want to save these settings to the modem so we don't have to do it anymore. We type in A, T, and W. That will save the settings to the modem. Now they're saved. Okay, I'm going to clear the screen with clear home, press return, get an error, but that's okay. So we're going to see what our settings are. AT and V will show you your settings. Shows that we're at 9600 baud. Shows our Wi-Fi ID and password. These are our speed dial locations. These are ones that are preset in here. Um, 
I mean, you can change them at any time. And to see your commands that are available to you, type in AT question mark. This will pull up all your commands that are available. And you can see right there, set speed dial, AT and Z, and then the number of the um, line you want to save it in. So these are all your commands. Not very many, but it works great. Okay, we're going to test it out. We're going to dial into my BBS saved in slot 1. So it's ATDS 1. Press return. And you can see that we're connected at 9600 baud. And if you're new to the BBS, when it's asking for your member number, just type in new and it'll let you register. Once you're registered, you can post, ask questions, check it out. Hope this video helps.